Okay, so now we're going to download Windows Server into our virtual machine. So I already had my virtual machine open here. Now we're going to Google search Windows Server 2022 ISO. And it's this first link right here, so click on that. Scroll down to so get started for free, and we're going to download the ISO. Then you have to enter your information. It doesn't have to be your real information, just anything. And then we're going to click download now. And the we're going to use the English version ISO download 64-bit edition. So click on that. And your download should start, which will take a while. Okay, after a long time, our file finished downloading. So now we're going to open VirtualBox and we're going to create a new virtual machine. So we're going to click new and you can name this whatever you want. We're going to name it Windows Server. Um, we're not going to select the ISO image yet. The type is Microsoft Windows and the version, we're going to change that to other Windows 64 bit. Then you're going to click next. Base memory, we're going to allocate about. We have 7,000, and I only have four core processors, so I'm going to keep that at one because that's what it recommends. Click Next. Disk size is going to be around 74 when I try to go for. 72 is high. Click Next. Finish. And now the virtual machine has been created, but we need to add the ISO file. So we're going to start the virtual machine. It's going to take a second. It's powering up. Go ahead and full screen this. And it's failed to boot because the ISO file is not in there. So we're going to click this drop down and click other. And if we go to our downloads, our ISO file that we downloaded today should be in there. So we're going to open that. And then now we retry boot. And it should be loading to low slow. Loading up our files. And close this out. And now Windows Server. And if your mouse disappears to get your mouse inside, you just click inside or the screen. Okay, so English, English, US. So that's all right. So click next and then install now. Okay, so you can click, you can really use any of these operating systems. I'm going to use the OneDust Server 2022 Data Center Evaluation Desktop Experience. Click Next. Accept Terms. Put. Next. And we're going to do a custom install. It's going to go to the unallocated space for now. Click Now. And this part does take a while, but now it's just installing the operating system. So now our installation is finished. So now we're going to go ahead and set up a password. I'm going to type. I'm going to go ahead and type mine. Enter. And now Windows is loading. And it's finished. So in order to open your virtual machine, it says to press Control Alt Delete. But if you were to do that, it would open on your physical machine. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to Input, Keyboard, Insert, Control Alt Delete. And that opens your machine. Then you enter the password that you created. 
path okay now our server manager has opened and in the next video we're going to ad join our server and windows server has opened